What's going on everybody? Come back and let's see how this pack has held up over the last two years. What's going on everybody? Well, January 26th was the birthday for this pack for Mid-10 Outdoors. We picked this pack up on January 26th. My son did a, little, a day trip with it um, the following weekend. Great success, nothing tore up, nothing happened. Uh, he used it a couple more times after that and then I got hold of it. And so it's been hiking with me ever since. Uh, it's a Magellan 30 liter. This is called the Pinjack hiking backpack. Now, unfortunately, they do not make this one anymore. They have gone to the Ponderosa 30 liter pack. This is a 30 liter pack. Um, price point is if you're starting to get into day hikes where you need to carry a few, you know, few things on you, this is perfect. Uh, it's got a waist belt and arm straps of course it's got arm straps <laughs> but it's got a good waist belt with little bee pockets on it um, I use the pockets for like uh, video cards and stuff like that from time to time uh, don't have a whole lot hanging off of it right now I do have my personal alarm uh, I'll link the video to this alarm on here I will also link uh, the original video to this pack this is the pack that if you look under here, there's a zipper and pulls out your rain fly that goes over the pack. So we've had, like I said, we've had this pack since January 26th of 2016. So it has been, I will have to say, it has put up with uh, us. It has served me well. Um, it has a place for a water bottle on both sides. I always carry a metal water container container with me this is the pathfinder school water container always carry a metal one on me in case i have to make a fire and purify water uh make potable drinking water always keep snacks um that kind of stuff in this pocket particular pocket i got a flashlight some repair a compass not a gps a compass I do have another, um, this is a jet scream whistle. So I have all kinds of way of um, getting, getting help if I need it. But I will say, and I've been to the store and looked at the replacement pack for this. Looks just as good, has just as many pockets. Um, it, it'd be well worth the money if you're looking to start and don't want to spend a whole lot of money to get started in the day pack, day hiking. Uh, especially if you've got a family, you know, you get two of these, one for your wife, one for your for yourself, and you've got plenty of carrying ability between you. Keep a, a signal mirror in there. I gotta look through because I don't there's I don't have a whole lot in this thing uh, right now. When I go, I do attach my keys right here so they're not in a pocket and something happens, I lose my my uh, key to my truck uh, the little pulls are little but you know they've held up they haven't pulled apart um, deep inside the this thing has got a really generous um, bag on the inside as you see I have everything from a life straw to um, what I think money hands down is probably one of the best knives out there 15 bucks you get you a, a, a more knife you've got a good uh, sustainable knife for you in a survival situation um, and of course I've got other things in here too my um, fire kits in here um, you know keep one of these in here Shemug. I keep my Pathfinder cup in there for now I may go to something a little different, but you never know. First aid kit, 
And then, of course, before I go, I always grab a little bit of food, throw off in it. Um, like I said, this stays in, in the house. It doesn't stay in the car, truck all the time. Uh, it does have a place for a water bladder in the back. I don't know if you can see that, but there's the H2O port right there. So you can hang your water bladder inside here. I don't carry a water bladder in this thing. Um, for day hikes, I just carry two liters of water with me. And hopefully, worst case scenario, if I have to get more water, I can. Um, and having a life straw or something like that, I always keep one of these on me, just in case. I also keep a chem light on me. I also keep, uh, well, CPR mask on me. A little bit of first aid. I don't care a whole lot of first aid, but if you've got this, you'll be okay. Um, and I keep a big hand paracord, and there's a tarp in there if I needed to make some kind of shelter for the time being. Uh, let's see. Like I said, this is just a real quick overview of this bag. That pocket has nothing in it. Like I said, there's a lot of stuff to be added to this bag, and I just don't have it in there right now, and don't have a reason for it yet. But I just wanted to give you, you know, I've had it, we've had this bag for going on two years and it's held up good. I don't have any rip points anywhere. I don't have anything as far as, um, you know, any strains on anything anywhere. It's held up pretty good. What I do like is in the back. Let me pick it up so you can see back there. That is a frame. It's a plastic frame, but it's a frame so it keeps the pack sturdy. It, this mesh keeps it off your back just enough to keep air going back there. So anyway, guys, like I said, for 40 bucks, even if you just get one for yourself and you know carry everybody else's supplies in it, it's enough to get you out in the woods and get you hiking, get you on a trail, get to exercising. So I don't want to make this too long. It's already six minutes long plus the intro and everything. I just wanted to bring you a video. This is February, so starting Tuesday, the theme videos start coming out on Tuesdays. Thursdays, I'm going to start having more gear videos and um, possibly live stream, possibly you know hiking videos, and then on the weekends, you may get a bonus. So anyway, this is Patrick Minton Outdoors. Go check out the latest from Magellan Outdoors, which is Academy Sports, uh, which is the Ponderosa 30 liter. This is the Pinjack 30 liter, and it's done great. All right, guys, be prepared. What's going on, everybody? It's Patrick Minton Outdoors. Oh my gosh.